Hello everybody, my name is Farmer Phil and today we will be looking at course play on Farming Simulator. Today we will be looking at how to reverse tip a trailer, wagon, bale trailer, whatever you have into a cell point. Owen Briggs asked me to make a video on this to show him how to reverse into the silage pit at the cow shed on Westbridge Hills map. So that's what I'm going to do. And I'm sorry Owen if I did not pronounce your name right, just in case. So let's get started. So now, first thing we'll do is we're going to set up a course just to cut a bit of grass. Now, just for the purpose of making this video, I'm only going to cut a small bit of grass. You know yourself, you know, when you're cutting the field or whatever, that uh, if you look at my last video, making silage, it's in there how to do it. And it works better when you do it that way. But this is just to show you how, how to do it. Because you need something in the trailer for it to work. So we'll just start course recording. We'll just drive down a bit of this grass field now. We have to go too far. Just to put a bit of grass in the trailer. So we'll stop at that. We'll save this as whatever. I'm just going to put down this here. Just, just that you have to save it. So, and then next that. We'll drive on a small bit. And we'll start course recording. And now, we drive to the side of this so we'll just drive around and whatever way you want to reverse in if it's from the other side or this side it doesn't really matter but one thing you must try and get them in straight because they're not very good at following reversing or reversing with a trailer into an area so we'll just swing them around like that and we'll try and get them to be straight as we can so I uh, should do a how about that so then we hit her start reverse driving and we start reversing now I wouldn't go major turning about the place trying to get him in you just want to keep your reversing straightforward simple because you start doing big reverse you just you just won't do and you want to go well back into the pit because the pit has sort of no back end wall to it and the tip trigger is so large you can do it with the trailer on. When you're reversing into the feed barrier or into the straw cell point, you can't have the trailer on. You have to reverse as if you have a trailer on, but don't have the trailer on. It's extremely hard. I'll show you in the next part of the video. So, should do about there. Hit the reverse button again, and then drive out. Drive out. And I'll just drive out. I'm going to drive to where the start point is where I started popping last, which is just in the top of the line. So I'll just swing around now. And now, that's that. We'll stop course. Save this as in this one. Now, go back. And we'll load up. We are X down here first. And you load up your field first that you're going to cut. And then you load up the course where you're going to empty it. And then we set it to first waypoint, drive course. Yeah. Oh, wait, I forgot to put it. You must have it in field work. Forgot about that. You won't cut any grass otherwise. No. We'll just dive up to the end of that there. Swing round into the yard and hopefully he'll reverse back into the pit. Okay, now it can take multiple times to get the reversing right. It is. Oh, it's, it's an awful job to get it right. An awful job. You can see now he still has his mower down because the wagon is not full. It will affect his reverse mobility, but for the purpose of this video, he should be okay. This is just a rough idea to show you how to do it. When you're going to cut big fields and put it in the pit this way, you know yourself, right? You, you have to make it familiar to it. So, we drive up there, he has a fairly well straight. And Hopefully now he gets it. He, he seems to be doing well. You can see there he's going way off course. And here's the problem. You can see his tip trigger is reached, but because he can't reverse back to where he wants to go, he won't tip it. So if we stop diving, and we try and straighten him up a bit, and we send him to the nearest waypoint, he might... Nope. I'm going to really make a dog move. Uh, it, takes, it takes a lot of tricking. And I, oh, I, just, I spent a whole day trying to get him to fit straw. It's an awful job. Oh, an awful job. But you will get it eventually. It might seem like it will never work, but you will get it eventually, is all I can say. 
It just takes a long time to get right. I know. You can see he's still, he's still twisting it back. So, okay. It works. It just, it's very hard to do. In all fairness, I prefer driving straight through the pit. And he tips when you go through. It's a lot handier. So, now that we have a bit of signage in that on this bike, it's down. I'll show you how to reverse tip into the other spot. Now, we'll keep this video short and sweet because my internet is very, very, very poor at the moment and I can't upload anything over so many megabytes. So, I'm probably end up going into the town to lo upload this because I live in the middle of nowhere and the internet is maybe 10 gigabytes a second, which is useless, actually. No. I'm just going to take off the trailer because you can't when you're reversing into a small tip of trigger area you can't have the trailer on because when you reverse in with the trailer and set in the course plate his last stop is where the tractor is but when he goes to run that course the trailer becomes sort of part of the tractor and the minute the trailer hits the last stop that's him reach the end and he goes off and he goes next to nowhere next to near it so I don't know if it's a flaw, maybe the updated version of course they has that fixed, I don't know. I can't upload it or download the new version of course they has the internet so I'll just take off. Off the trailer. Fold up this lad. And we'll just go and give him a bit of running space now. I'll probably take off the more as well because it's only in the way. It's only in the way. Now back back. Post recording there, and we just drive. So when you're doing this, you want to be dead square, or you have to be dead straight coming back. You know, drive up a, a, good, a good bit now, trying to make sure you have your trailer square that because you, you can't, like, there's no trail behind you to know what way it's going to go. So I, you know, which way do I turn? I always give her, no, I always give her a little twist that way try and straighten up the trailer and now all you can do is just go straight back and hope this is why you can take so many turn times to get right and sometimes you get it right but every now and again he makes a P0 so you want to go back fairly well somewhere about there you don't want to go uh, the whole way back or the trailer won't go the whole way back and won't tip or whatever but for this now you set a waypoint. It's the easiest way to do it. I can't get him to tip itself in there. So I set a waypoint. And when he has done his round of the field and comes in to tip, once he gets there, you get your blue sign coming up there saying he's at his waypoint. And then all you have to do is press Q, unload, and then continue driving. Sorted. He'll keep going. So that's, that's the easiest way. I, I can't figure out how to get him to tip when he reaches that, that tip point. And it's the same with the straw. I can't get him, so I set a waypoint when I have him straightened out into the shed. When he gets there, you get a blue symbol up there, he's at the waypoint. You switch to him, press Q, he unloads, and then once he's moved, he drives off. Oh, well, no, you have to come to continue driving. So that's, that's it for now. We slap him back into the forward, and we just drive off all the way. We stop course, and now I'm going to put back on the wagon and see what way he does this way. Probably won't get it right. Look, it, it takes a lot of time. You gotta be awful patient to try and get it right. I think out of the four hours I spent trying to work this out this morning, I got it right twice. So it's it, it's hard going. It's hard going. It's, yeah, it's just very hard going. So I just line them up now. Right. No, I want this to set the first waypoint. So you guys are from there. No, this is the moment of true. I won't get that right because he's coming in at too much of an angle to get lining up straight. Yeah. Oh, maybe not. He might be right. We can do his first try and he actually goes back. No, and he tips it himself. Well, by years, that's the first thing that's ever happened. Now, you know what to do to get it to work. That's it from me. Please like and subscribe to the channel. Please leave comments like Owen did. If you have any problems and want to learn out, to find out how to do something, let me know. I'll make a video and show it to you. That's it from me. Good luck.